So my final review presentation is on the romantic comedy, The Holiday. It is directed by Nancy Myers, uh, who you may know her um, by some of her other movies like Something's Gotta Give, The Parent Trap, and Father of the Bride, just to name a few. It came out in 2006 and it stars some of Hollywood's biggest names like Kate Winslet, Cameron Diaz, Jude Law, and Jack Black. Uh, I'm going to be honest, romantic comedies usually aren't my thing. However, I absolutely fell in love with this movie when I saw it in theaters. I have seen it more times than I care to admit. Um, so I'll tell you why I think this movie is so fantastic and worth a viewing. Uh, first a little background information on the movie in case you haven't seen it. Um, Cameron Diaz plays a movie trailer maker and she's very successful. She lives in Los Angeles in this huge gorgeous mansion. But she's a workaholic and her relationship is failing. So in order to get away she goes on a home exchange website and she meets Iris who is played by Kate Winslet. Iris lives in Surrey, England and she finds herself kinda in a similar situation uh, as Amanda. Iris is a journalist and her ex-boyfriend cheated on her so, of course, she finds out that he's engaged to the woman who he cheated with. So that prompts Iris to want to leave for the Christmas holiday. So the women switch lo uh, houses and lives, uh, kind of in order to find themselves. Um, so this kind of leads to one of the three main things that I loved about this film. First, it's the scenery. Myers captures the differences between these two lives so well. Everything is just so beautiful and fitting to their lifestyles. Uh, Iris lives in a little cottage and it's quaint and cozy and tranquil as it's surrounded by snowfall. Uh, Myers really pays attention to detail and it's very evident in her scenes. Um, as Manola Darges from the New York Times describes it, Amanda, Amanda ends up in a sweet country cottage that looks like as if it has been drawn by Beatrix Potter. And it goes to the extreme opposite as Iris steps into Amanda's huge and lavish lifestyle. It's a far cry from Iris's country lifestyle. So it's no wonder she was elated when she uh, showed up to her mansion. Uh, the second thing that I loved about this movie is the music. And it actually plays a big part because Jack Black's character uh, he is a film score composer, so music really plays a focal point throughout the movie. Uh, the music just fits every scene perfectly, and I personally get in a really great mood when I hear it. It's very upbeat most of the time, but it does go through some somber points. Um, it just, it's very appropriate with every scene. Uh, one downside is that Black's romance with Winslet's character doesn't get as much attention as Diaz and Law's relationship. Uh, according to Derek Armstrong from a review on allmovie.com, the storyline gets the short shrift, given only hasty romantic angle after she's already spent considerable time befriending a screenwriter. Uh, the third and probably the biggest thing I felt truly made this movie is the actors. They played them honest and believable, and I feel it was true to Meyer's vision. They had ph phenomenal on-screen chemistry that was just evident every second. Although I believe uh, romantic comedies might be unfamiliar territory for Jude Law and Jack Black, they really pulled it off and came off genuine and lovable. Uh, Myers did a great job orchestrating their relationships to bring out stellar performances. Glenn Sumi of Now Toronto said, the cast pull it off, selling their character singlehood, nailing their occasional sight gags, and earning our laughs and tears, which often occur in the same scene. Although I'll admit it, there are a lot of corny moments, but I will quote Iris by saying, I like corny, I'm looking for corny in my life, and so should you. I cannot recommend this movie more, and as Ken Fox of TV Guide puts it in a review, Admitting that it's formulaic doesn't make it any less so, but it's enjoyable in a mushy, easily digested sort of way. To each their own, but you should get out there and see it.